We have received the latest luggage guideline information from Norwegian Cruise Line. If you will be selling with Norwegian Cruise Line, this is information that you need to know and we're going to share it all with you coming up. Okay, seven Norwegian Cruise luggage guidelines that's what this episode is about. But if you're with us for the first time, my name is Jason, and here on the Travel Scouts, Kelly and I aim to be your cruise information channel. So if you love cruising, consider subscribing. Okay, seven Norwegian cruise luggage guidelines. Let's pop right into it. We do not like to waste your time. So, number one, let's talk about the quantity of check bags that you're allowed to bring. Norwegian Cruise Line allows you to bring two check bags, which is pretty good because a lot of cruise lines just allow you to bring one. Good job, Norwegian. Number two, what about the size and the weight of those checked bags? Well, according to the luggage guidelines that we have received from Norwegian Cruise Line, there is no size dimensions for those checked bags. However, they do have a weight maximum. Each of those checked bags can only be up to a maximum of 50 pounds each. If you are bringing 100 pounds of items in your checked bags, you are bringing a lot of stuff. However, some of you may be going on a super long cruise with Norwegian, so that's okay. But they do have laundry, y'all. Just saying. Let's move on to number three. And number three has to do with what Norwegian wants you to know about bringing a carry-on bag. They have noted that whenever you check in your luggage, you may not see that luggage for at least a few hours after you get on board the ship. And in a similar way, they also wanted to remind everyone that if you're using their assistance when taking your luggage off the ship, then all of those suitcases, they are collected up the last night of the cruise. So Norwegian Cruise Line wants their guests to know that it is pretty important to consider bringing a backpack or some sort of other carry-on with you. This will make sure that you have the stuff that you need with you during those times when you don't have your checked bags. And Norwegian Cruise Line has specifically stated that in this carry-on bag, they recommend that at a minimum that you bring your meds, your valuables, your important documents, and any other need-to-have items. Rolling right along, told you we don't like to waste your time. Number four, this has to do with the markings and tags on your luggage. Norwegian Cruise Line has stated that it's really important that each of your check bags are clearly marked with your name, your address, and also a contact number. Additionally, each of your check bags will also need to be tagged with one of the Norwegian luggage tags. Now, in order to get these, you can print them yourself online. They're on your eDocs page there for your booking for your Norwegian cruise. It is on the last page of the eDocs. You can print that there. And they said they highly recommend that all of those luggage tags from Norwegian be applied to your luggage before you arrive at the cruise port. We are already to number five. And number five has to do with Norwegian Cruise Line's recommendation to consider bringing a converter. They've noted that the electrical current on board their ships is 110 volt and 220 volt. However, some high voltage hair dryers, electric rollers, electric razors require a converter to be used. So depending on what you're bringing with you, you may want to consider bringing a converter. Kelly and I always bring a converter with us. Down in the video description, we have a nice to haves list. So check that out. You can see some of the various items we like to bring with us when we cruise. Number six, the number six Norwegian cruise line luggage guideline is to make sure before you cruise that you are familiar with their prohibited items list. So you can go to their website, you can check that out, but let me just give you a real quick rapid fire list of things that you cannot bring on your cruise. Some of these may surprise you. You cannot bring a drone. They are fun to fly. You can get some great video footage and all of that, but Norwegian says no. You can't bring an iron or a steamer. Norwegian is afraid that we're gonna burn the ship down. That's possible. You cannot bring a laser pointer on a cruise. I've never thought about bringing a laser pointer, but that would be fun. I'm sure you could do some little stuff with that, but they said no. Of course, you can bring no sort of weapon. You can't bring any kind of flammable stuff. No candles. And with Norwegian Cruise Line, you can bring no water or no soda. That's something key to know because on other cruise lines, you can bring water or soda. The only exceptions they have to this is if you need the water, for example, for a medical device or some sort of special need or for a nursing kind of situation with milk or formula. But you have to get special exception for that. So bottom line, Make sure you're familiar with the prohibited items list, especially if you're planning to bring something questionable. And then the number seven Norwegian cruise luggage guideline has to do with luggage drop-off. 
Now look, if you're a seasoned cruiser, this is just nothing new to you, but if you are cruising for the first time, the luggage drop-off can be a unique kind of situation. You roll up to the cruise port, you get out of your car, you're looking around, seeing where you're going to check in and all of this stuff, and some porters will come up and they will go ahead and take that luggage from you and load it up to get it on the ship. You can be wondering, who in the world is this person? Are they really going to put it on the right ship? There's lots of ships around here. What's going on with all of this? But I want you to know that is completely natural, completely legit. That's how it's done in the cruise world. Just make sure you're showing up to the right port and you should be okay. Hand it on off, go check in, have a good cruise. Okay, that's it with these Norwegian cruise luggage guidelines. We wanted to make sure to get that information to you, but be sure you subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss the next updates. God bless you and we'll catch you in the next video.